Hello everyone and welcome back to Enchanted Bayou. Unfortunately, I come to you with some not so good news today. Uh, we are here to talk about Steven Twitch Boss. Uh, that was his name. He went by Twitch, though. Uh, he recently succumbed to, I guess, a, a long depression that unfortunately no one knew about. And he took his life on December 13th of this year. I thought that we probably needed to do a spirit box session. Unfortunately, in times like these, it's good to send my spiritual guides, Ethan and E, out to see if they... If he needs help, if he needs help crossing over or, or anything along those lines. So I thought we would do a spirit box session today, see if he needs help and see what message maybe he wants to leave to his wife or if he has any message for his fans because so many people are shook up by his death. He was an amazing dancer, an amazing chore choreographer, amazing actor. He was the producer of The Ellen Show for many years and on The Ellen Show, I think, for like eight years. So he was just an amazing man and everyone is stunned because in every interview that I've heard of people talking about him, they talked about all the light and the joy that he would bring into a room when he was in there and all the people's hearts that he touched, that he was just an amazing man and that him taking his life was really out of the blue. So. I thought that we would talk to him today, see how he's doing, and see if there's anything that we can help with. Someone who has touched so many, I think, deserves an opportunity. Well, I think everyone deserves an opportunity to get help and make sure that they're okay and get their final message out. So that's what we're going to do today. If you are new to my channel, thank you so much for joining us. I do have some, I guess you could say, like house guidelines of things that we do here. Uh, the first is I don't cut and I don't edit my spirit box sessions. So whatever I do is going to be completely raw. And I also have a professional, though, review those spirit box sessions with me. He was in the Navy for 10 years listening to radio noise. I guess you could say kind of like a spy, but yeah, spied on other countries through radio communication. Also, if someone does need help crossing over, I have two guides. Their names are Ethan and E, and they will help them cross over after we're finished talking to them. So you don't have to worry about anyone. Everyone will be taken care of. That's just what they do. They are amazing, amazing spirit guides, and and they take care of everyone. They're just, they're fantastic. And the last thing is that the spirit box noise on spirit boxes, this is the spirit box that we will be using. It is the one that you've seen on pretty much all the ghost shows. It is a PSB7 spirit box and I just have it attached to a regular old speaker but the spirit box noise sucks. It is very loud and so if you are wearing headphones I really recommend that you adjust wearing headphones because the volume is going to get really crazy so I'm sorry for that but again I want you guys to be able to hear every single thing that I hear so that's why I don't cut it that's why I don't edit it and that's why it is really loud and really raw and if you are returning and joining me thank you guys so much you guys support lately has been so meant so much to me just meant the world to me. I really appreciate the comments and emails and everything now that I'm back and you guys have been there for me. You guys have been wonderful. So thank you so much. I don't get enough chance to say it in the comments, but I want to thank you here for always coming back and being there for me and love you guys. Hope you guys are doing well. Let's get into this spare box though. Let's talk to Twitch and see what we can find out. I'm going to go ahead, set that up. This is the the warning for the sound, and I will be right back. Oh, got the spare box going. Okay, Ethan and Eve, we want to talk to Stephen Boss. He goes by the name Twitch. Twitch, when you're there, can you say your name?
that was okay so of course at this point I don't know everything that was said um, I did hear him say that he was here really clearly heard him say that he was here I heard him say the state that he lived in which was Alabama and also the uh, the goodbyes at the end so in between I'm going to have to do a little research and have my professional listen to it but wow that was even in his voice I've heard a lot of interviews recently with him and just seen him on TV a lot of course because you know a lot of people are talking about him unfortunately regarding his passing and yeah that that was probably one of the well I don't know that that as far as voice coming through that was that was amazing so anyway I hope you guys like this video just keeping this short and sweet I just want to make sure that he didn't need help I wanted to give him a chance to get any messages out and I figured you guys might be interested in that too so if I was going to check on them, I wanted to make sure that I included you guys in all that. I hope everyone's doing well, and I love you guys, and I will be talking to you very soon. Oh, another thing. Please don't forget to like and subscribe this video. It really helps me out, and I really appreciate it. It just gets the channel out to more people so that more people can see the videos, so that they can enjoy all the stuff that we enjoy doing, too. Hope you guys are doing good. Again, love you. Talk to you soon. Bye.